ABC 13 Eyewitness News at 9 starts now on the CW39. Now on Eyewitness News at 9, students left wondering what's next after the Art Institute of Houston suddenly announced it is closing. Plus, for the first time, we're hearing from a man who says his skull was smashed by officers at the Harris County Jail. And people from all over the world are in Houston to see Queen Bay. How local business leaders say the economic impact from Beyonce's concerts compare to Taylor Swift's. And we begin with breaking news in southwest Houston right now. Police are sorting out details of a shooting that killed two men at an apartment complex along Bissonette near Brayburn Glen. Investigators say one victim in his 20s and the other one is in his 40s. Police say the men were walking on the sidewalk when a small car pulled up. Several people inside got out and shot the victims and then took off. Police believe this was a gang-related shooting. Investigators do not have any suspects at this time. Students say they're dumbfounded after the Art Institute of Houston suddenly decided to close its doors. The announcement came yesterday via email. ABC 13's Alex Basargian is joining us now live. And Alex, what kind of options do students have at this point now? Maida, right now things are really up in the air. There was an email that went out to students and the Art Institute say basically because this came together so last minute and so fast, they didn't have the time to engage with other colleges and universities to try to create a formal agreement that would streamline the process for students to transfer and finish their studies. So right now it's really on students to figure out what they're going to do next.